This is Umar Ahmed for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. We're in Las Vegas. I've got Martin Thompson with me. Uh, this is a, a strange moment for me because I'm a big Line of Duty fan. <laughs> so it's great to get you on IFL TV. Uh, we're down here at the top ranked gym watching Josh Taylor train here. I take it you're a big boxing fan, Martin? Aye, aye. You know, I mean, I kind of claim to be an expert or anything like that, you know, but just. Like my boxing, um, Josh has become a good pal over the years, so it's exciting to come down and watch him sort of firsthand. Uh, it's good to have him and uh, young Lee over, uh, a fellow Scots kicking about Vegas, so I know it's just really excited to be here. Yeah, of course, uh, you share that being Scottish, and uh, I take it you know Josh well as well? Aye, aye, I've followed his career for a long time before I got to meet him. Um, He's just one of those fighters. I mean, he's fearless, but he's just he's exciting to watch. I mean, technically, he's so gifted, but, you know, he loves a battle as well, you know, so I, I, I've... I've I think I've watched just about every, nearly every, all must have been all of his professional fights. I've given, none, none of them have been boring, you know. Um, um, he's the one guy I don't worry about, because any time I ask him about his next opponent, it's always the the same quote, and it's, I kind of get in, wait to get in there and take his head off. That's all he says, you know, the boy just loves fighting, you know. He, um, but he's a top lad uh, out the ring, you know. He's a, he's a very generous lad, very, very loyal guy. So, aye, he's, he's a good mate. Well, you sound like a big fan of him. I hope he's a fan of you. Aye, well, it depends how many bevies he's had after a fight, you know, but um, aye, he's a, he's a top boy. I take it you were um, at his undisputed fight with Ramirez, obviously you live out here in Vegas, so... I mean, it's been it's been really unlucky, actually, because when he's been fighting here, I've been working in the UK, and actually, so when he's in his next fight as well, when he's back in the UK, I'll be over here, so I've kind of missed him, but I'll always make sure I'll be, I'll be watching along with him anyway. What's next for you then, uh, yourself, Martin? Uh, usually when I'm here, uh, I'm sort of on a break. Uh, I mean, all my work and I split my time between here and the UK. Um, so usually when I'm in Vegas, I'm not working. So just a bit of downtime. Uh, it's been a busy year. It's been a busy couple of years. Um, so just trying to enjoy a bit of time with the family. Uh, maybe kind of get to the start of New Year and then come out all guns blazing again next year. But I just, just try and relax a bit. I look forward to it. Obviously, you said uh, you are into your boxing, so I'm just going to ask you a couple of more things. Obviously, Tyson Fury's based himself out here for a large part of his uh, recent career. Um, how do you kind of assess the heavyweight division? Do you watch it a lot? And what do you think of Tyson Fury's recent win over, over Wilder? Ah, it was amazing. I mean, you go back to the days like Lennox Lewis and Frank Brown and stuff, that was exciting, but... For a long, long time there, you know, the heavyweight decision, uh, a division, it was it was just, it was boring really, and that's not you know, anybody who's became heavyweight champion of the world, you know what I mean, obviously that's that's a, a huge honour for anybody, but um, it's just exciting again, you know, there's fights out there, and but I think Big Tyson, you know, he's just, he's sort of in a, a league of his own, you know, as a character and as a fighter, so uh, it's just been, it's been really exciting. Yeah. Did you uh, manage to see Anthony Joshua's fight as well, with Alexander Rusik uh, back in the UK? I did, I did, but I mean, again, I think, um, again, Big Anthony, uh, He's obviously, he's became world champion twice now for a, for a reason, but Yusik, I mean, the talent that guy, that guy's got is is unbelievable. So, I mean, that was always going to be a tough fight. So, fair play to Joshua for taking it. And it's exciting to see who, who Fury fights out of them next. No, definitely. Well, listen, Martin, unbelievable to get you on IFL TV. Uh, a lot of people, of course, will, will know you from Line of Duty and, and your other work. Uh, is there anything you'd like to close off with? No, no, just all the best, pal. Thank you, Martin. Cheers. Cheers.